Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Sav. If you're returning, thank you so much. Welcome to today's video. We have got another Primark haul. Now I say it because the last one you guys seemed to really, really like and it kind of, you know, got loads of views and it was only a mini, mini one. So this time I went to Birmingham, as if you are an OG, you kind of know that that's, that's one of my spots. That's where I go because it's the biggest in the world, not too far from me and you can pick up some absolutely great bits. So went back there and you know, lo and behold, there was new stuff in and it's really, really nice. So I just have to haul it for you. So let's get straight into this video because I'm so excited to show you some of these bits. So the first item I picked up is um, this black long sleeve blouse. It was 10 pounds. Ladies and gentlemen, £10. I got it in a size 14 just because, and I'm glad I did actually, because it's quite snug. Um, and I tend, I have quite a broad back. I don't know if that's kind of like unbelievable, but I do. Um, yeah, so I picked up in a 14, which I'm glad I did because it was quite like restrictive. So it's just this lovely black blouse. Now, I don't know if you're going to be able to kind of see the detailing. And let me know, I kind of haven't done actual try ons, but let me know if you like the try on bits of the video so that I can put them back in. But I don't know. So let me know if you prefer them with try-ons then i'll do try-ons but otherwise if you're happy with me just kind of showing you as is then you know there we go but yeah um it's got like a scooped neck so again i don't know if you can kind of see it's going to be difficult to picture hopefully that kind of gives you the gist of it um, but you can probably see just from me holding it up that it kind of scoops um which is really really nice i was looking at one like this on pretty little thing which i'm pretty sure was like 25 30 quid so when i saw this for a tenner it's just a bit of a dupe and it's just a really nice you can really wear this in quite a few different ways so it'd be quite a nice going out top whether that's paired with like leather leggings or jeans or you know like a brunch vibe with the gals it's got a really cute gold button detailing hopefully you guys can kind of see that if i cover my face hopefully you guys can see that but yeah it's got this stone detailing no it's got this gold detailing on the cuff and yeah you could also wear this a bit more formally whether it's to the office to work or whatever but it's just kind of got that elegant classy look to it so yeah picked it up it was only a tenner i couldn't couldn't not do it then i picked up something that i think is going kind of viral on tiktok i got it in a size large because again if you're an og you're gonna know that i like things sized up i like them a little bit baggy but i do probably i would recommend sizing up in this but again it depends how you want it to fit but I just think it kind of comes up short and kind of cropped but it's this zip up striped jumper i think this is like a kind of zara dupe um because of the quality of it it's got two pockets at the front i really really like this but i don't know i don't actually like it on i don't know why but i just don't i don't know i don't know what it is but I just don't like it on me so I love it on other people I've seen it and I was like you know I really wanted to pick it up I did actually pick this up on the last haul but I didn't haul it I don't think um or maybe I did I don't even know but I picked up a different size in my last when I last picked one of these up I don't think I bought it home actually to show you but no I did pick it up in a different size I tried it on it didn't fit right I went back obviously saw that they had a bigger size in a large and got it it's 17 pounds but it just again it just didn't didn't sit right on me i just feel a bit bulky in it to be honest so this is going back but it is absolutely gorgeous still i mean i do really really love it i love it on other people and i've seen it on tiktok like i said it's got lovely pockets at the front which is very handy i'm such a pockets or kind of well no i'm a pockets gal i think i always need them because i just need to put my phone somewhere and sometimes i don't always want a bag so that's that the next item i picked up is this jumper it's an off the shoulder jumper i picked up in a medium it was 13 pounds and again it's just really really cute so you can wear this with leggings so it just looks like this comes off the shoulder absolutely stunning i picked it up in black i think they also did have a white one um but you know what whenever i wear white i just drop stuff down me so i was like if i get this and if i like it enough to keep it then it's going to have to be a black one because otherwise it's just going to get absolutely ruined. So yeah, it's really, really soft. It's like blanket soft material. So stunning. Like I said, again, with this, you can dress it up, dress it down, wear a bit more formal. You can wear this as a kind of work from home, casual lay around the house outfit vibe, trackies, leggings, or you could dress it up with jeans, heels, um, put like a blazer over the, over your shoulders with it. But I love the whole off the shoulder 
I just love it. It's just cute and it just looks so put together without actually having to do anything. So yeah, again, for £13, you just have to do it. Then it wouldn't be a Primark trip if I didn't actually pick up leggings. So I did pick up some leggings. I picked up the bog standard and of course I'm wearing them now, but bog standard, £7 leggings. Like when were leggings £7? I swear they used to be like two or £3 and they do have £3.50 ones which were on the hanger, but they are the really, really thin ones, the ones that I think just go really see-through. So I do like to pick up the thicker ones, which explains why they're a bit more expensive, but I just don't remember them being seven pound a pair. Like, I just don't. So I also found these whilst I was stood in the queue. These are super cozy leggings. They've got like a brushed fleece lined feel to them. I don't really know if you're kind of gonna be able to tell from the camera, no you're not. Um, but I picked these up in a small slash medium because I generally kind of like to be i don't like them leggings to be too baggy because it just otherwise bags everywhere like at the crotch and it's not very flattering so i tend to size down a little bit with my leggings when i know they're the thick ones because obviously otherwise they stretch and you're kind of going to see everything and nobody wants to see that so pick them up they were three pound fifty and yeah i'm quite excited for these because like i said they're thick they're thicker ones but they're not the extra kind of fur like faux fur lined ones that i got last year and it's still a bit warm for that because I did debate picking them up and I'm like, just, it still is warm. Like it's just muggy all the time. And although I am literally longing for winter, even the days it's raining at the moment, it's still hot and I just can't deal with it because I've got, I keep buying jumpers and winter stuff because that's where I absolutely thrive. And I just can't wear it because it's, it's just too hot. So anyway, um, moan over, got some leggings. I know I just went on a big thing about saying I'm not going to wear white, but I saw this and I absolutely fell in love with it. So I picked it up in a 14. It was £28, ladies and gentlemen, £28. And funny enough, I went to River Island after this and they had a similar one in, which was £70. So it's a cream long, I don't know what you call these, long lined coat. And it's got a belt as well. Again, it's got pockets which I love and these ones aren't actually kind of stitched are you focusing and these ones aren't stitched so you know I don't know why Primark do that they stitch up their pockets and then sometimes you have to like snip the stitch to actually make use of them or is that just made people not do that but I like pockets and they do actually work as pockets when you snip the thread so yeah like I said 14 I picked it up a little bit bigger I probably would have got away with a 12 but I picked it up bigger because if I want to put like a jumper or a thick woolly um well like a hoodie or a jumper underneath then or any knitwear then I think you just need to size up a little bit because otherwise it's going to be quite tight on the arms so yeah but it's just absolutely gorgeous I can't wait and I just get scared that it's going to get covered in makeup but I can't wait to wear this stunning then I picked up an oversized t-shirt this was seven pounds and I got it in a large because again I want that oversized feel to it it's just something that's going to go with everything and like I said because it's still kind of muggy at the moment then I just need something but I still need to feel a bit wintry and stripes are definitely in this winter. So I picked up this oversized kind of boyfriend fit t-shirt, black and white striped, very basic, very simple. Again, leggings, jeans, you can dress it up. It's just something that will go in the wardrobe and be quite happy to sit there. And what I'm trying to do is be more conscious when I'm buying clothing for things that are actually gonna be diverse and can be in the wardrobe for longer than like a couple of days, do you know what I mean? Because you know, at the end of the day, we are still in a cost of living crisis and we can't be affording clothes all the bloody time. So what I'm buying is things that will either be long lasting or will be diverse, kind of take me right through to summer and won't just kind of be, be out of fashion like in the next, two three weeks or whatever so yeah pick that up because again this is something i could wear in in summer spring you know it's going to see me through it probably won't last that long because i'm going to wear it to death in the winter and then it's going to be really kind of tatty by the time that time comes around but for seven pound you know it you just don't you just don't mind then my favorite purchase of all in this haul is a coat slash jacket it was £35, so it was even more expensive than the cream one. However, it is an absolute dupe for a Zara jacket I've seen, which I wanted for so long. I actually saved it on my Pinterest board, I think, last winter. Um, I will put a picture from the Pinterest board on here so you can see why I was in love with it. I picked it up in a medium. It's a 12 to 14, and I just fell in love with it. I couldn't have thought of this Pinterest board. Um, picture as soon as I saw it couldn't believe it so it's this grey I think it's kind of 
what's that? I don't know how you say it. Buccal kind of look to it. Um, but it's not like a just a flat grey. It's kind of got a mix of different greys. It's like speckled. That's kind of the thing I'm looking for. Yeah, it's almost like speckled, so it gives it a bit more depth to it as opposed to being a grey jacket. But it's almost like a bomber, I think. That's how I would explain it. Um, you can see that you've got like an elastic waist at the bottom. You've got pockets. Again, I can't really have a jacket without pockets. But yeah, it's just the dupe for the Zara one. I mean, I know the rest of this video wasn't a try on, but hopefully, I mean, it's just so cute and i could imagine this with jeans and a big chunky scarf and it's not too much of a coat coat but it's enough of a coat that it's going to keep me warm and it's not going to be too warm and it's just yeah and i also found this in zara similar not zara yes i did see it in zara um and it was a lot more expensive than 35 pounds and i also saw a dupe for this in river island which was slightly different but again, it wasn't £35. I can't remember off my head how much they were, but it definitely wasn't £35. It was definitely, definitely more. I think the, Zara, uh, the River Island one was about £50. So you're saving. And this is a dupe, and I just love it. And it's actually really, really comfy. So, yeah, love, love that. And it's just enough room that if I wanted to put a hoodie underneath, or like I said, I want a chunky scarf, and it just makes me really happy. And I just love the fact that we're going into winter because... It just makes me happy and I love winter. So yes, that does, I should probably take this off tonight. So yes, that does conclude today's little Primark haul, another little Primark haul. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. And let me know about the try on bit, whether you will actually prefer me to try on the clothes so you can see them on or whether you're happy for me to kind of talk through how I'm feeling, how I'm vibing with the clothes, any of my first thoughts, because sometimes I do try them on in the shop. So what I tell you is, you know, cross my heart hopes die god's honest truth so yeah hope you enjoy thank you so much for watching and i will see you in my next one bye